A church in southern Spain, an unlikely focal point for the kissing scandal that's engulfed Spanish football. It's where the mother of Luis Rubiales has gone on hunger strike to protest the treatment of her son, who's under pressure to resign after kissing the Spanish player Jennifer Hermoso on the lips following their World Cup win. His cousin spoke outside the church. Of course he's suffering because he doesn't want his mom to be put in this position. But his mom knows what he's like. Those who know him know who he is. This type of media reaction is not normal. He's not a harasser. What is not normal is that this girl did what she did. She was playing. Everyone won. They were champions. Everyone was happy. And three days later, she says it was harassment. Are we all stupid? Rubiales has already been suspended by football's world governing body, FIFA. But the 46-year-old made a defiant speech last week, saying he would not quit and claimed to be the victim of a witch hunt. Falso feminismo. Spain's second deputy prime minister, Yolanda Diaz, says the behaviour of Rubiales and others at the Spanish FA has been unacceptable. If I am to give my opinion, all those people supporting Mr Rubiales do not have the competency to remain in their post. Those who clap at a violation of rights, an alleged act of sexual harassment, a forced kiss, it's obvious. They must not continue in their positions. It's all very clear. Women's rights are non-negotiable in Spain or elsewhere. The kissing row has made an impact internationally including in Mexico City, where Barcelona's women's team is preparing for a series of friendly matches. We need to find a solution. There need to be consequences. I hope steps will be taken for inclusion and progress to avoid this kind of stain on female football. With this disgusting situation, everyone wants to support Hermoso. Everyone has stood with Spain and with women, and I think this is positive. It's terrible. There was power abuse and sexual harassment during an international event that everyone saw. The more serious thing is that they are questioning a player when everyone saw it and there is video evidence. Spanish prosecutors have now opened a sexual assault investigation against Rubiales, this scandal unfolding at a time when Spain should still have been celebrating winning the World Cup. David Stokes, Al Jazeera. Make sure to subscribe to our channel to get the latest news from Al Jazeera.